I created this cocktail as a tribute to Game of Thrones based on the book series A Song of Ice and Fire. If you decide to make this cocktail, make sure to take extra precaution as fire is involved. Here's the equipment you'll need to create this cocktail. First, you'll need an ice ball mold. Now to extract and inject liquid into that ice ball, you'll need some kind of seasoning injector or syringe. The type of glass we use is very important because the glass is going to get a bit hot. And because we're introducing cold liquid to this hot glass, there's a risk of the glass cracking. So I recommend using a tempered glass, which has a higher thermal shock resistance. You'll also need something metal and sharp. You can use a paper clip here, for example. To support the ice ball on the glass, you'll need a long bamboo pick. And the fuel for the fire is going to be a high proof alcohol. Here we're using a Gosling's 151. And of course you'll need matches or some kind of lighter. You can find links to purchase all of this equipment at cocktailchemistrylab.com. Okay, let's start by making the ice ball shell. Take your ice ball mold and pour some filtered water up to the top. Then drop it into the freezer and you're going to leave it for about an hour and 15 minutes. Then flip it upside down and give it another hour and 15. This is to ensure that it freezes evenly. It's going to freeze from the outside in and you want about a quarter centimeter of a shell remaining with the inside still being liquid. To extract that liquid, heat up that seasoning injector and insert it directly into the top of the ice ball. Extract all of the water from inside of that ice ball until it's just a hollow shell. Now take that sharp metal object and poke a tiny hole just a little bit above the equator of that ice ball. Insert the bamboo pick and stick it all the way through to the other side. Then create another hole straight across and stick the bamboo shoot through. Now there's probably still going to be a tiny gap where the pick comes through. So put just a few drops of water on that hole and then put it back in the freezer to create a full seal. The cocktail we're going to create to put inside the ice ball is called the Havana. So start with some 80 proof dark rum. Squeeze in some fresh lime juice a little bit of Cointreau, some simple syrup for a little extra sweetness, squeeze in a splash of orange juice, and finally a few dashes of orange bitters. You can find the measurements to this cocktail recipe at cocktailchemistrylab.com. Now you want to shake this one up nice and cold so it doesn't melt the ice ball. At this point, go ahead and prepare the glass by pouring in some of that high proof rum. Now, it's also a good idea to have a glass of water nearby in case there's an issue with the flame. Okay, now it's time to fill up the ice ball shell with your cocktail. Grab the seasoning injector and very carefully inject the cocktail inside of the ice ball. Fill it all the way to the top. Now you're ready to present the cocktail. Carefully ignite the liquor at the bottom of the glass. Then with two hands, slowly place the ice ball directly on top of the flame. Make sure that it's centered. The flame will slowly start to melt the bottom of the ice ball. Soon the shell will melt and out will come the cocktail and extinguish the flame. Thanks for watching this cocktail tutorial. If you want to see more videos like this, you know what to do. Cheers. To get these detailed recipes, find links to purchase the equipment, or get early access to the videos, visit cocktailchemistrylab.com.